Hi guys, it's Lynn here. And Hans here. And I hope you're having an incredible day. Now today guys, we are down from Belfast to visit Dublin for the day. And we're going to one of our favorite garden centers here in Ireland called Urban Plant Life. And I've made a video here before, probably a couple of years ago now, of my visit here. It's absolutely incredible. And um, Sam, the owner, is a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful guy. And we're back again, me and Hansi, to visit again and go plant shopping. And as we always say, there's always room for one more or a few more. Yeah, a lot of more. <laughs> a lot more. But we have to see her if anything to buy. Oh, yeah. So let's go, guys. We're going to take it's... you. Uh... <laughs> We're going to take you with us and yeah. uh, see what there is. Yes. We have to plant shopping. Yes. Oh, here we go. <laughs> and as I say, <laughs> it's a urban plant life. And that's the opening hours here. Ever you're in Dublin, and or you live in Dublin, or you live in Ireland, it's a wonderful Sam. place. And there's Sam. He's a wonderful guy there. So we've been to a yeah. plant life quite a few times. Cat owner. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, he loves cats too, which is good. So here we go, guys. And uh, gonna take you around and have a look at the planties. Now guys, this is Urban Plants Life Cat and <laughs> isn't he just adorable? Look at this little cutie! <laughs> and uh, let's go and uh, have a look. This is all the sort of outdoor plant selection. As I say, I've already done a video on um, an amazing tour around of Urban Plant Life. So links up above to the video of um, this incredible garden centre and uh, show you a complete tour around there. So I won't go into too much detail now. I'll just go and show you um, when we're at the house plant section. Now here we are in the bonsai, cacti and citrus house here with all the plants for sale and um, here we are Hansi's already there having a look around and look at this guy oh my gosh yeah there is lots of beautiful beautiful looking cacti here for sale oh look at that that is gorgeous we have one of these it's like a little miniature one and oh wow oh, gorgeous 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 and maxi crop yep and uh, look at this oh Lovely big aloe vera. Look at that lovely patchy podium. Patchy, isn't that gorgeous? Oh, look at that. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Oh, wow. Euphorbias. Oh, my God. I think I can feel a bit of a spending spree coming on with me and Hansi here. <gasps> look at these guys. Oh, a spiralis. Me and Hansi have been after one of these for absolutely ages. And just look at this gorgeous euphorbia. <gasps> Hansi, what do you think? Yeah. Oh it's, my gosh. It's a happiness to see it. Yeah. It is so wonderful, I have to say. Um, oh gosh, wow, look, to show these spiralises. I definitely think they're going to be coming home. Well, one of these is going to be coming home with us. And uh, as I say, lots of lovely, lovely choice here. God, look at this. Mm -hmm. And uh, we love shopping and no, plant what's shopping. This? What's this? Oh no, fake flowers. Oh no. <laughs> but um, the good thing is, these flowers look like they've only just been put on. So yeah, that's so great news. Nothing wrong with a little bit of decoration. It's the ones that are actually stuck through the plant that, like, oh, these are actually just pretty put on. <laughs> that's good to see. They're not stuck on. But I have to say, what an incredible espostoa. Wow. Look at the size of that. The only trouble we would have is how the hell would we bring that back, Hansi? <laughs> oh, I love this oh, little yeah. poro cactus. Yeah. Oh, that is so gorgeous. Is yeah. yeah, and a Hoya linearis. Yeah. We have one of these, um, but that is lovely to see because they're not often found for sale. And I love this poro cactus. That is gorgeous. Oh, <laughs> that is gorgeous there. And I have to say, what I really fall in love with, definitely, definitely one of these spiralises. Oh, my golly. And uh, there's just so much choice. I'm just like really overexcited. This is absolutely beautiful euphorbia, I have to say. Oh, isn't it? <laughs> and as I say, this is the cacti, succulent and bonsai um, 
part. But there's also um, a house plant section as well, which we're going to be having a look at because um, they usually have some beautiful ferns here too. So that's very exciting. As I say, beautiful large espostoas, and good to see that the flowers are completely harmless. Just put on for a bit of fun. <laughs> And uh, look at these guys. Some beautiful um, echeverias and aloes here. Selection of a few different ones here too. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Wonderful choice. Very happy to see here. I love this opulsia. Oh, look no, at that. It's not an that. opulsia. It's, a, or, oh, it's a lovely and, uh, larger puncture anyway. Yeah, it's the opuncia group. But it's yeah, it's part of the opuncia group. It's not the not an austro-cylindro puncture, no? No, not that either. It's uh, not one of the roundy ones. Oh, epiphyllum. Do you know, I remember seeing this epiphyllum here before. It's been here. This guy here has been here a long time in urban plant life. And I sort of liked it the last time. I don't actually know what type of flower it produces because epiphyllum is quite large. And it's been cut back. But I just really feel like this one probably does need a bit of a rescue. It's been here a long time. So um, you never know. Might be rescued. Um, <laughs> might be rescued in the future. And uh, some more euphorbias here too. And look at this, this is a um, lovely large mellow cactus that's obviously been flowering. By the way, the music in the background, guys, is already playing Urban Plant Life. I think Sam plays the music to um, make the plants feel relaxed. And it certainly works, because they seem to be very happy. <laughs> and it's lovely to actually walk around a garden centre with really nice, relaxing, tranquil music instead of that awful pop rubbish that a lot of them play this is so nice and relaxing i have to say so this is really nice these look like these are a few little ones they're propagating here by the looks of it some little odds bods <laughs> little ends on this might be a little one that could be being propagated possibly from yeah possibly from the mummy plant there i think this is the mother plant and i've liked this for a long time because this has been in urban plant life for a long time and i would love to rescue it but it's too large to carry back because we, we know we're going to be getting a few plants today. But this is a cutting of this one, possibly. You never know. I'm going to put it back and put it back and see. But uh, yeah. we love our epiphyllum. Here is a Cleistocactus winterii, which we have. It's a little little plant there. We're always on the lookout for ones we haven't Euphorbia got there. Yeah, trigonus. Euphorbia trigonis. Yeah, that's lovely too. They look like nice cuttings too. Trigone is there, and uh, a few little more, it's a beautiful one, we have one of these also, and all up there, look at that guys, wow, isn't it incredible? What I like to see as well is Sam has this nice and lit, bright as you can see there, with also with grow lights and lovely natural lighting too, so these plants are well, well looked after, well, uh, plenty of light, these massive big euphorbias here, look at that. Wow, <laughs> lovely bigger punches, lovely seed pods. Oh, how gorgeous. <laughs> beautiful, 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 beautiful. Wow, look at these amazing uh, euphorbias here. Aren't they cool and wacky? Wow. Small, oh, poor old cactus. Wow. Loads of different types of mixes here, bonsai and citrus. And some more nepenthes there too. And uh, saracenias. Wow. Ha 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 ha. Ha 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 ha. Some more little high low serious. Yeah. Oh, look at them. Oh, sorry, my loving. <laughs> and another big uh, Hoya Linearis there hanging down. And here we have some uh, some bonsais. Cactus mix and everything under there. So that's a bit of a tour around here. So um, we've had a look and see what see what we like here. Now, that's obviously not a real Tilantia. <laughs> it looks it, but it's actually uh, not real. Nice little cactus cards there, lovely handmade cards, aren't they gorgeous? It's uh -huh. really nice. And uh, 
So, I know what I'm going to go for anyway. I'm gonna ask Hansi what he's gonna go for. We usually have very similar taste. And as I say, me and Hansi, we don't really, we're very careful with our money. We um, don't spend much at all other than house bills. We put a bit of money every week aside that we have left, everything is paid. And at the end of the month, we treat ourselves to plants. So uh, we're very careful. So we're not people that just go out buying for the sake of it. Well, <laughs> I have to say, there's a spiralis is definitely going to be coming home with us. What do you reckon, Hansi? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> It'd be nice to have one. Though. Wouldn't it just? And but which one do we choose? That one is gorgeous because it sort of goes curly all the way from the bottom. But that one's sort of nice because yeah. it also goes straight and then goes curly like that. Mm. Lovely, aren't they? This one is possibly the most sort of yeah. I think hard to choose because they're all so cool. But we're going to pick one there. What do you think? I think so. Now this one is sort of, it's a really nice healthy one. Mm. Lovely, isn't it? Oh yeah. I sort of really like this one. And I think that one is a healthy one as well. What do we do? This one. Yeah. Cool. I like this one. I, I like the way it's sort of curly all the way from the bottom. Shall like a I listen skeleton. to you or shall you listen to me? <laughs> I know. Unless we have one each, why not? No, no. I like Are you <laughs> sure, my lovey? <laughs> so that's our first one. I get uh, Hansi, so that's a definite must. <laughs> now, I really like this, but it all depends on the, the cost. It might be a bit expensive. Isn't it? Twenty-four ninety-five. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a, it is a beauty. Um, so definitely the spiralis and uh, I think we're going to go and have a look at some of the house plants as well and uh, see what there is there. I'm not quite sure how much that little cutting is of that. We have got plenty of epiphyllum but it'll be sort of nice. What do you reckon? I think we go for it because it's always good to have epiphyllum from another one and you want that one, I yeah? think so. I'm not quite sure, but we'll take that. Always room for more, as they say. <laughs> and uh, now then, what would, what else would you like, Hansi? You. Ah, thank you, my lovey. <laughs> this big one. <laughs> <laughs> that, yeah, that uh, would be amazing. Wow, I know, isn't that we'll incredible, that guys? We'll that Wouldn't one. that be lovely? Oh, yeah, yeah. Get a big van and bring it back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the bus is like that big, huge aloe, my God. And this one, I want that one. Yeah, that is yeah. beautiful, isn't it? Then oh, yeah. he wasn't getting the bus back. <laughs> oh, wow, 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 wow. So that's that anyway. That's yeah, that's beautiful. Beautiful. I think I'm going to leave this euphorbia for now, but I have to say, it is a beauty. And uh, I think that's me done here anyway and uh, I think I'm going to go then and have a look at the house plants <laughs> now guys we've come back in again because Hansi has spotted a cactus here that looks gorgeous and we're not quite sure what it is I think we think it's a mellow cactus looking at the spine arrangement and also the top there, it looks like it's a beautiful mellow. So this is one that's going to be um, obviously going into the polytunnel, but overwintered indoors Inside. because mellow cacti like to have a minimum of 10 degrees Celsius, mm. which is around 50 degrees Fahrenheit. But we've got a couple of mellow cacti in our collection. So we're going to be overwintering it with its two little, two little brothers. <laughs> so there you go, guys. That's our cactus hall for here in the cactus uh, greenhouse. Um, this one I think is a mellow cacti. Mm. Good choice, Hansi. Our beautiful spiralis, serious spiralis, and a little epiphyllum cutting. So yeah, there you go. You Isn't that wonderful? That one, yeah. Oh yeah. And it's now, a um, shoot, yeah, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> a little shoot, me, oh. <laughs> a little shoot there. So yeah. Um, yeah. there you go, guys. And I'm going to be taking some photos of each one individually mm. to mm. put on Instagram. <laughs> if, you, if you're not familiar, follow me on Instagram, Desert Plants of Avalon. Mm. And uh, then now we're going to go to the house plant uh, section. Woohoo! Now we're at the house plant section. As you can see, there are house plants, artificial flowers, and plants. And 
normal plants. <laughs> and um, I've been here many times. They always have an incredible, incredible selection of many different house plants for sale here. I see lots of different types of soil as well, which is always good to see. It's not easy to find. House plants, soil, and orchid soil, and, soil and for everything. Artificial plants. And soil for artificial plants, yeah. <laughs> they never need watering. And some of these lovely peperomias, they're gorgeous. And some pilia peperomioids, that's not often seen for sale. We have one that we got from our wonderful friend Nelly from collection of unseen nature um, so we're very lucky there but they're not easy to find often um, and we have some tillantias commonly known as air plants there too good to see a wonderful selection of house plants here and uh, oh gorgeous gorgeous and uh, just take you a little bit of a bit round tour around and as I say I have done a video already of a tour around of urban plant life so I won't bore you guys <laughs> bore too much with going around again um, not that I'm sure I'm boring you if you're anything like me you can never see too many plants <laughs> but I'll give you a little bit of a quick tour of how everything is in here and uh, they often have some beautiful um, selection of plants and I can see already there's some wonderful ferns here oh my god what do you reckon Hansi oh. <laughs> look at oh look at these these are gorgeous it's asplenium type oh look with at that the, asplenium yeah with the ruffled leaves wow. the edges of the leaves almost like a staghorn isn't it yeah. look at that that's mm. beautiful oh my golly and um Diwalia there not often seen for sale Oh, that is good. Oh, look at these. This beautiful fern here. And look, it's one of the Devalia types with the lovely wow. hairy rhizomes. Mm -hmm. Oh, how gorgeous is lovely that? Color on it, Isn't that a lovely, look, almost like a fluffy barefoot? Oh, oh yeah. grrr. <laughs> we love our Devalias. We have a few different types in our collection with the, the lovely hairy rhizomes. And um, Tillantia's here. Uh, me and Hansi have got plenty of Tillantia's. Just not sure if there's anything we haven't got here. Looks like we've already, already got these ones here. Um, that are here <laughs> so no need to go there but uh, definitely with these fernies oh my gosh wow beautiful beautiful and look by the way guys uh, this garden center has the most incredible huge 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 plants which is absolutely amazing if you have big lovely big house or big conservatory look at this like a jungle all beautiful beautiful plants mm -hmm. amazing Shall and, we uh, take the jungle too? Yeah, yeah we're going to take the jungle too. Well, <laughs> I wish we could take it, but we could certainly give you a, <laughs> a bit of a quick tour around. So say lots of amazing plants here. Gosh, incredible. Mm. Incredible. Wow. I definitely think a couple of these ferns are going to be coming home with us as well. And, uh, oh, gosh. Look at that. Definitely one of these. And definitely one of the hairy ones with the hairy rhizomes as well. It's beautiful. Wow, let's have a look. It's one there. That looks so lovely. Oh, look at that lovely hairy rhizome, guys. Oh, my gosh. The new leaf, the, oh and the new yeah. leaf just coming through. As I say, the, the Devalia yeah. um, types of ferns are amazing with their hairy rhizomes. They take moisture from the air yeah. and nutrients too. Oh, look at that beautiful little fern as well. Ferny oh, That's gorgeous. I think yeah. that's going to come home as well. What do you reckon, Hansi? No, yeah, why not? I think that's a beauty, isn't it? Mm. Oh, we love our ferns. We have a selection on our table in our kitchen, all on a tray. Um, we water with rainwater. They seem to be very happy there. So, and this one as well looks like a good, a good healthy one here oh, too. Wow, Look at that. Yeah. Look at that. A splenium with a difference. Yeah, yeah. Wow. So I think we're going to go for this one, that one, and this one. Would this one too. I think so. Yeah. Wow. What a plant hall, guys. And the half jungle. <laughs> And the half jungle. I wish. <laughs> and there's a selection of all the amazing outdoor plants here. A couple of greenhouses too. Absolutely fantastic. Look at that. There's a load of tomatoes growing in there. And beautiful plants all up on the top balcony there as well. Sam has an incredible selection of um, incredible, incredible, incredible plants. Always for sale here. Absolutely amazing. So guys, there we are. We have bought our amazing plant hall. And um, I just want to say, guys, that if ever you're in Dublin, 
please go and visit Urban Plant Life. They have an amazing selection of plants. And also, I'm going to put links down below to their fantastic Facebook page. Please do go over and like them on Facebook and also link to their website as well. It's got a lot of the plants that they sell on their website too. It's a lovely place here. Yeah. It is gorgeous. And just look at that. As I say, links also up above to the video I made on the tour round of this beautiful garden centre. And um, <laughs> it is fantastic with our lovely plant tour. Look at this. <laughs> our fern hall and a cacti hall there. Absolutely <laughs> wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> and guys, please do go over and subscribe to my wonderful fiance Hansi's oh, YouTube channel, you. Family of Cactusy and, and other, other beauties. beauties. Links also up above to Hansi's amazing channel. Please do go over and subscribe. <laughs> Thank you, <laughs> So darling. guys, I hope you've enjoyed the video. Yeah. And I want to send you loads of love. Heaps of happiness. Happiness and, and tons, tons and tons, tons of plant. plant. Power. Power. As, As always, always from, from Ireland. Ireland. Until the next video. Bye. 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 <laughs> <laughs>